and he threw me against the wall and I was so scared because I didn't know you could touch people in auditions. So I'm like, what the heck are you doing? What the t -t -t and he starts yelling at me in this audition. And then like, they said, cut. And they went, that was really good, Ricky. You look so scared. <laughs> and I said, thank you. <laughs> green, green, green. And then you just have a director over here yelling at you, telling you what you see. Um, and so, I mean, I've, I've, I've done this before sometimes at, at places. And so this is what I have to do as an actor. When you work with green screen and you've got to pretend it's the best thing because it's like your inner child comes out. So it's like when you're a kid and you play cops and robbers and cowboys and Indians and stuff. It's a lot of fun. You have to make believe. And so I don't know whether you remember episode. I think it was episode. Yeah, episode one, season one of American Gods, where Shadow's dreaming on the plane and he sees the buffalo for the first time. So I don't get to see any of that. All well, that's CGI afterwards. So all I get is number one it's a they made this tunnel so it's about this long this tunnel and then they cut out this scene where i had to crawl through that tunnel in this dream and i'm dragging myself and all these things were cutting me and they they didn't use any of that so i dragged myself through puddles and dirt and thorns for nothing because they didn't use that so i was very angry but when i come to the tree I've got to pretend that this tree is here, it's magnificent. But there's nothing there, so it's all on me. So, I come out of this tunnel, and I see nothing. It's just like an empty room like this. And so I go like this, and the director says, so it's a big tree in front of you. It's bigger than that. And it's so wide, wow. The other side. Yeah, it's so huge. Look at the tree. I'm looking at the tree. Which part of the tree? All of the tree. I'm looking at all the tree. Okay, wow. There's a buffalo walking behind. The tree, Ricky. Oh. Where? The other side. There he is. Okay, there's the buffalo. It's a bigger buffalo. It's a big buffalo. No, that's, that's not the buffalo. Where's, where's the buffalo? <laughs> so, you like this, and you go, okay, fine. There's the buffalo. And the, I couldn't figure out where the buffalo's eyes were, so they had to put, <laughs> they had to put these, like, two, two flames, like flaming tennis balls on a stick. So now you've got a man walking towards me like this. <laughs> He doesn't want to look at me because he thinks he might put me off. She's like, I'm being professional. I don't want to disturb your acting. <laughs> That's more distracting. I was like, it's just a bit. It's fine. That would be fine, but no. <laughs> so I'm watching this and it's all like, believe and all that sort of stuff. And so. This director's shouting all this stuff, and you just have to hope as an actor that you don't look stupid when they put in all the special effects. But fortunately, we have in our in our post live a very happy life. I wake up every day, that's a blessing. I'm breathing, walking, I have a great job, I have beautiful friends and family. I'm here in Austria because of the passion and support of you guys, you know. So anyone in this room should feel blessed because we're all alive. We're all kind of able to do things that a lot of people can't. So we're all very blessed and all very lucky. And so I will always say thank you before every meal. I'll always say grace before every meal. Because I'm always eating. That way I know I'm always going to be thankful. So at least three times a day I'll say grace before my meals. Just to say thank you for the life that I live. Because I feel very happy. Um, and yes, I have problems. I have a lot of problems. Don't think that my life is perfect and I'm perfect. I'm not at all. Um, I make mistakes, I have problems, I have issues, I have things that I worry about, but I say that life is about making choices and happiness is one of those choices. I don't look for happiness, I decide to be happy. 
So when I wake up, today's gonna be a good day. I don't have bad days, I have bad moments. There are moments like, I tripped over, I hurt my leg, or my girlfriend broke up with me, or they're, they're bad moments, but I won't let it ruin my day. And if I don't let it ruin my day, that won't ruin my week, month, year, life. I focus on the positives. And so, I just believe that you should just always focus on the positives and whatever makes you happy. Um, as long as you're not hurting anyone. So if that's a god, if that's another religion, if it's your favorite Britney song, I don't know, is she still relevant? I don't know. No? No? Okay. <laughs> Lady Gaga. Oh wait, is that more modern? Ariana Grande? David Hasselhoff? I know you guys yeah. love David Hasselhoff. <laughs> what? Could you explain why? Watch out, there's a tree on stage. I think I know in my head, but I don't, I'm, I don't actually know this. I've never heard this before. First set up. Good. Great. Was ist das? Uh, that is something that you're on very often. It's a TV. Fernseher means television. Oh, I thought it was a tree. <laughs> my Deutsch is schlecht. Close. But there is one last word. A last one. Uh, that I have prepared for you. It's a little something called... What? <laughs> <laughs> okay. First board and slice of Martian, you got my life. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> How are you meant to say? Holy shit, that was great. It's first board and slice machine for life. And so we were doing this scene, and we were driving along, and I could feel that the, the blanket, the duvet thing, um, was moving, and I thought it was falling. So I was trying to catch it, because that was where, how you were able to see me with, with the light. But when I tried to catch it, it kept moving. Ian McShane is pulling it <laughs> off my lap. So I'm trying to keep the light on my face. And I tried not to laugh, and we finished the scene. And then the director came up to me afterwards, he says, that's, that's, that's fantastic, it's, that was really good, Ricky. Ian, beautiful, I loved it. And he didn't know how to say it, because he didn't want to sound racist. <laughs> but he was like, we couldn't see you, Ricky. 